Hi, my name is Anakit Sarkar. I'm a seventh grader from Pineview School in Osprey, Florida. I'm super excited to share my project, Moisture Farming, the Atmospheric Solution to Agriculture. Food security is essential to a country's economy and growth. A lot of our country's food comes to the American West and Midwest, but with water shortages, it can lead to food and economic insecurity. However, there's an unlimited source of water, the atmosphere. I took inspiration from the increasing amount of droughts due to increasing climate change, which can lead to rising crop prices and can impact consumers and farmers. I decided to implement everyday materials to create our first prototype, which consisted of a plastic bucket which had a row of copper coils on an aluminum foil roll. I used a pump to pump ice cold water through these copper pipes right here to cool them down so when water vapor came in contact with these pipes, it condensed and collected as liquid water to water a plant. I then evolved into a second prototype by adding a fan on top for a faster air intake rate, adding double the copper coils to double the copper coils between double the amount of condensation produced. I added foam insulation on the outside of the bucket and added a foam box to insulate the ice water that we would be pumping through the copper pipe. I tested both prototypes from 3 to 9 p.m. and overnight, with prototype 2 having almost double the amount collected as prototype 1. We also tested soil moisture with this meter right here in this box, with prototype 2 having over 65% comparison to dry soil, which is 5% soil moisture. I envision this prototype to be brought to the real world with these large grain bin models on farms, which appear as grain bins on the outside, but on the inside of rows upon rows of copper coils kept cold by a compressor pumping water through them. This is powered by solar panels or other renewable energy resources. And as the fan takes air in and produces water, water is a mass at the bottom and used to irrigate full-scale fields. I plan to achieve this in the future by first creating a planter bed model, which will serve for vegetable gardening and at home. Overall, this prototype would help 1.4 million farmers in America who face an increasing drought with increasing climate change. And it would reduce carbon emissions by reducing the need to store and transport water. Thank you.